I'm Linda Whitaker. I'm a distinguished professor at the University of the Witwatersrand in the Centre of Excellence for Human Development. Currently, I'm a fellow at the Stellenbosch Institute for Advanced Study, STIAS. I'm a developmental psychologist, which means I study the processes of development. That means intellectual development, emotional development, language development, physical development. All the processes by which children and adults develop across the life course. My real interest is in very early child development during pregnancy and the first two years of life. And what I'm going to be talking about at the Steers Lecture is a book I've just finished called Birth to 30. Now Birth to 30 covers um, a major part of my work over the last 33 years. It's a birth cohort study of more than 3,000 children born in Soweto, Johannesburg in early 1990, who we have followed for all of these years. We have studied all aspects of these children's lives and their mother's lives and the grandchildren's lives. So in this lecture, I'm going to talk about how the study was set up, what actually prompted it. It was truly an um, anticipation of an urbanisation crisis as influx control and the past laws were cancelled and was anticipated to be a great swell of urban living. So that's what prompted the study, but it was very much affected by the political conditions at the time. For example, the hospital strikes, uh, the fact that health services were completely fragmented for different population groups and at the municipal and the ward level and the regional level. Um, there were differences in where people got their services and how they got services. So I talk about how the study was set up, and then I go on to talk about what were the great scientific achievements of the study. And the, the one I'm going to concentrate on is the importance that we learned about the first two years of life for long-term health and human development. Remember, we were able to trace these people into adulthood, so we can trace what in the early years was important for laying a foundation for people to be able to reach their human potential. 